As I was researching advocacy campaigns, I realized that many campaigns don't fall into a definition of advocacy, that is trying to change government or corporate policies. I came across one of my favorite campaigns, Love Food, Hate Waste. According to its website, we're here to help you explore simple ways to save food, save money, and save our planet. In other words, Love Food, Hate Waste helps people to understand the food waste problem and reduce food waste in their household. It's a fun and creative public awareness and educational campaign and has proven impacts on reducing household food waste. But I was looking for an advocacy campaign intended to change policies rather than household or lifestyle practices. I'm somewhat obsessed with the problem of food waste. After all, according to the climate organization drawdown.org, Reducing food waste is the number one action we can take to draw down greenhouse gases from the atmosphere, with reducing meat consumption number two. So I decided to explore another food waste organization, ReFed. ReFed's mission is to achieve a 50% reduction in food waste in accordance with the United Nations 2030 Sustainable Development Goals. Its work fits with the definition of an advocacy campaign a strategic effort to achieve specific advocacy goals within a defined period, which entails multiple activities such as letter writing and meeting with policymakers. In launching its food waste advocacy campaign, ReFed investigated where in the food system greenhouse gases are emitted and what solutions reduce those emissions at what price. Drawn on rigorous data, ReFed produced the interactive solutions database I strongly recommend you explore the database of over 40 food waste solutions. You can sort the solutions by their climate, water, and financial impacts, by food groups like produce or baked goods, and by stakeholders like government or food service companies. I explored the solutions database and discovered, to my surprise, that in terms of emissions reduced and money saved, the most impactful solution is consumer education campaigns. Here is where an organization involved in advocacy can interface with a consumer education or public awareness organization like Love Food, Hate Waste. That is by advocating foundations and governments to support these very effective consumer education campaigns. Once you are knowledgeable about the food waste problems and solutions, you can think about how to communicate the information. Let's say the city government Fortunately, ReFed has not only the interactive solutions database, but also lots of great infographics you can share. Here are two figures that can be used to communicate about where our food waste comes from and where it goes. Another great source of infographics is our world in data, such as this chart comparing food waste in different countries. Infographics such as these are essential in communicating about the food waste problem to public officials, so are stories about the problem, the actors, and the solutions. Once we are knowledgeable about how to communicate about the problem, we will want to identify the strategies to use in our advocacy campaign. ReFed has a searchable database of food waste state and federal policies, as well as recommendations targeted at local, state, and federal governments, corporations, and philanthropic foundation and it holds an annual Food Waste Solutions Summit for government, business, and nonprofit food organizations. Usually, advocacy coalitions lead advocacy campaigns. ReFed is part of the Zero Food Waste Coalition of Research and Advocacy Organizations, such as the World Wildlife Fund, National Resources Defense Council, and Harvard Food Law and Policy Clinic. Working together, the coalition developed and launched the U.S. Food Waste Action Plan, endorsed by over 60 businesses, nonprofits, and local governments. The goal is to build momentum on food waste policy, including what organizations can do. In short, advocacy campaigns employ a myriad of strategies to influence policy. And if all this seems overwhelming in your quest to discover your advocacy role, you are not alone. In fact, there is no reason for you to act alone. There are lots of advocacy campaigns ranging from trying to get countries to sign on to international climate agreements to urging schools to serve healthier, low-carbon meals. 
Rather than think you have to launch a campaign yourself, choose the climate issue that you want to advocate for and explore existing advocacy and related education campaigns. Find ones that appeal to you and join forces with an advocacy organization and coalition.